guys, Courtney here, and I have a package. Now, this is weird because today is Labor Day, Monday morning. It's actually currently, I think, like 9.20, and this package came on Labor Day at 8.15 in the morning. <laughs> I'm, I have no explanation. I have no idea why, um, but the mail lady showed up at that time and um, was like, okay, I was certainly not expecting him today, obviously, because it is a federal holiday. So I'm not sure what was going on there. I was expecting him tomorrow. So this little one here um, is actually uh, just a kit. Uh, just a silicone kit, but his artist very sweetly included some little goodies. That's so nice. So we've got a brush and comb set. We have a cute little Mickey pacifier. And it looks like we also have... Here's one sock. I'm not sure where the other one is. Oh, there it is. We also have a pair of little puppy socks, which is super cute. So I have the certificate underneath here, but I will show it to you in just a moment. I do believe he is in two pieces currently. His head is, doesn't, it feels like his head is not attached to his body. So just FYI, <laughs> you get freaked out by that kind of stuff. Um, I will uh, go ahead. I will put his head on his body once I have him unwrapped and all that. So, oh yeah. So we've got a head <laughs> and we've got a body here. Oh my goodness. I've been paying this little one off for quite a while so I've been really excited to get it. Oh wow so for this particular kit um, it had the option of getting him in the very super soft silicone which that's what I'm so so excited about. Um, you guys know that how much I love soft cuddly babies. Um, Rosanna is poured in a very very soft a silicone and I absolutely love it. it feels very real some people would argue some people would say that it's too soft to be real but I, I actually disagree with that um, because Ecoflex like Ecoflex 20 which is it feels real like maybe around the limb area limbs area but the, the stomach area which is such a thicker part of the silicone was always to me even in ecoflex 20 too soft i mean too hard to um i don't know to feel real when you were like holding the baby so i have had um i have had a baby from this artist before um actually in kit form so um, i'm really excited because her work is really good really good so let's start with the face Oh my goodness, look you there, look at that little face, oh my goodness, and he fa he greatly favors um, the baby I had before, and you guys can probably already tell who this is, oh my goodness, so soft, so soft, very sticky though, because that's the, that's what happens with the soft silicone, and then, let's get a little arm out here. Oh, looky there. Look at that little hand. Oh my goodness. And we've got another little hand. Oh my word. He's so soft and he's so sweet. Um, I'm going to, let's see if I can uh, manipulate this and get the leg out without showing you guys anything. If I mess up, I can always edit it out. So there's a little leg. And a little foot. Oh, he's so little and sweet. Let's get the other leg. There we go. There we go. Oh my goodness. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to cut the camera and I'm going to put a diaper on him. Uh, I will show you his little backside. And that's probably not a big deal. <laughs> um, and then once I have his diaper on, um, I will... Uh, Turn the camera back on so you guys see a little bit better. All right, guys. So here he is, and he is wonderful. He is so soft, so super soft. Um, I would say, I don't know. I would say maybe not quite 
as soft as Rosanna is, but I mean super close. He's still like ridiculously soft. Can you see that? Soft and cuddly. Uh, I believe, if I'm not mistaken, he was poured in Ecoflex 5. So, like, if you think of that in comparison, <clears throat> um, there's some babies that are poured in Ecoflex 10, if you guys are familiar with it, even softer than that, and definitely so much softer than Ecoflex 20. Oh, my goodness. He doesn't have armatures, but his he's so soft that, look, I mean, you can position his hands, and they, for the most part, stay. Like, look at that. That's crazy. <laughs> And his little legs curl up and straighten without the armature because he's so soft you don't need it. Oh my goodness. So cute. He does have an open mouth. Let me zoom you guys in a little bit so you can see. It's an open mouth with a really cute tongue. So um, a couple years ago I did um, his... Sorry, now that I'm thinking about it, I can't, rem I couldn't remember if I had gotten the, um, but yeah, I think I did. If you, uh, get this kit and you want the eyes, they do cost a little bit extra, and I did opt for that. Um, I didn't for, I don't think I did for the other kit, but, um, that I got. And it still worked out fine, but, I don't know, I almost prefer them. They can do a better flawless job than I can. So, it does have a cute little tongue in there, and so much reminds me, so what was her name? Her name was, I want to say, Leanna, maybe? I know that the boy version was Liam, and then hers was, I guess it was Leanna, something like that. And I um, did her for the um, International Doll and Teddy Show 2017 doll show. She was the first doll I sold. I sold her the first day. Um, she turned out amazing. Her silicone was so nice to paint. So super nice. I'm going to bring you guys down in just a second to um, show you his details. He's so cute. Let me show you his back <laughs> really quick. You going to see his little booty? Let's look at that. Get the little legs folded under. Let me show you guys that. Oh. And get the diaper open. So there's his little booty. It's so cute. Look at that. Look at and his little legs kind of curled up. That is so cute. Here, give me this leg. Like that. Look at that little butt. It's so cute. Um, but yeah, I'll put the camera down so you guys can see his details. I love him so much. Oh my goodness. Um, I was, so I was debating because, um, initially I ordered him for me, thinking, oh, I wanted a full, I have a full body girl, I wanted a full body boy. But then as I um, kind of looked through my, you know, was, I guess, paying attention to my collection, I was like, you know, what? I really don't need a full body boy. Um, like, for the most part, boys don't have, like, a need. Like, their outfits that you can get them don't necessarily show you know, anything like that wasn't necessary. So, I mean, Asher was enough for me. Um, and then I was like, well, um, I'll at least get him to paint and to sell. Uh, I can do that. And I get him suck his thumb. That's so cute. And, um, but then I said, you know what? I actually, uh, Alina, by the way, Alina Westbrook is his sculptor, his poor, exactly what I do with his, um, here we go. So this is Charlie. Yes, right here. Silicone blanket Charlie originally sculpted and casted by Alina Westbrook. Um, January 7, 2018. Now I know that he wasn't poured on that date. I guess that's when the original um, sculpt became available. But she just poured him when I finished painting him off. Um, I want to say two weeks ago or so. Um, but so then I had said... Uh, I'm going to paint them and sell them. And then I said, there's actually two more kits that I want to get for her, from her for the doll show next year. So then I thought, well, maybe I'll just sell Charlie as a blank kit uh, and then get the other two instead. And I was like, you know what? No. <laughs> um, looking at him, I definitely want to paint him. And what I'll wind up doing is just paint him uh, and then sell him once he's finished and then be able to get the other two kits. Um, which is the smiling one. She has, um, I think this, their name's Mishka, Mishka, and one of them's sleeping, one of them's awake, and they're both smiling, and they're really cute. 
but I really loved Charlie's little face. He has such a sweet little face. So let me bring you down here. Got the cutest little feet. As far as I know, he's still available. Um, this kit cost around with the um, soft silicone. Um, it's a little bit more expensive because it's harder for them um, when they demold them. There can be a lot of imperfections, so then they wind up having to go back in and fix the imperfections. So basically, it takes the silicone artist a little bit longer. Um, to work on these kits before they're able to get sent out. So if, because of that, I want to say it was like, it was at least $100 more. It may have been a little more than that even to get the super soft grade. Um, so just keeping that in mind. Um, he was a little more expensive than her just regular kits are. Um, but even then, I think with the eyes and everything, I want to say I paid, was it $1,600? <clears throat> is that right i can't I honestly can't remember <laughs> it's been it's been a while because i i uh, made, was able to make payments on him which is of course really nice because i wouldn't have been able to get him but he's so cute how much time are we at well i don't know because i didn't look at the other time i actually wanted to put a little outfit on him because um he's a little bit will be a little bit easier to handle because he's very sticky super sticky he's picking up all kinds of fluff right now which I expected, um, you know, he'll have to have a nice bath and all that before um, he's painted for sure. So cute. So I'm just going to put him in this little sleeper to protect him. And it looks like he's definitely a smaller newborn size. Definitely. He is um, maybe, I don't, can't say for sure that he's necessarily preemie, um, but he's definitely, definitely a smaller newborn. So I just wanted to put... This little, this is like the, think the smallest newborn sleeper that I have. So I was hoping it would fit him decently. Oh, come here, buddy. Let's pull this up. Okay. Goodness. Oh, he's so cute. I highly recommend her babies. Her babies are always really nice. Like I said, the um, one that I worked on a couple years ago. Um, in fact, I, if I'm not mistaken, she hadn't been casting... Her baby's very long at that point that may have, have even been her first cast and it was it was amazing she was amazing to work on she really was you can definitely tell the difference between a nice quality silicone kit um and a, and a low quality one like you really can some people are like i want to get the cheapest kits available um and paint them and sell them so i can make more money um in the long run but that's actually it's you wind up giving yourself so much more work getting a kit that I don't, and I don't necessarily mean that cheaper is lower quality that's not what I mean by that um, you can definitely get some kits for a good price a decent price and they're um, not low quality by any means but what I mean is like you can definitely tell artists that have experience and um, know what they're doing have a passion and love and their perfectionist about pouring you can definitely tell a difference and they're so much better to work on he is so stinking cute and look how cuddly he is can you guys see that he just snuggles up like that can you guys see the little snuggle bug that he is Let's see if i can do the bendy test he is really soft oh yeah he does have a ball jointed head i forgot to mention that um, and then once, so once he's matted and all that, it'll turn really nicely, but right now it's sticky, but oh, he's so, so cute. <laughs> oh, I love him. All right, guys. Well, I hope you enjoyed watching this video, um, and definitely look for some updates on Charlie in the future. I am finishing up one full body silicone and I definitely need to work on Bernice's baby. She is definitely next on my table. Um, and then I imagine, um, I imagine Charlie will be after that. So definitely keep an eye out. Thank you guys for watching and we will see you in a, another video very soon. Bye bye. Thank you so much for watching. If you like what you saw, maybe take a second to hit the subscribe button. If you want to, that is. No pressure. But if you decide to do so, there's also a bell notification right next to that subscribe button. Can't miss it. 
That way you will always get notified every time I upload a video. Again, that's also extremely optional. No pressure. But we have fun here, so it can't hurt, right? Ha ha ha. Courtney out.